Hello Scorpio and welcome to your career and money reading for October 2022. It's for the sun, moon, and rising sign of Scorpio. It is of course a collective reading, you guys. Take what resonates, leave it doesn't. You guys know the drill by now. Be sure to check your other signs for any additional messages that may be coming through for you. If you guys like my content, please like it, share it, hit that subscribe button, guys. I really appreciate it. We continue to grow and I cannot thank you enough. So thank you, thank you, thank you. If you're goodness, user error. If you're new to my channel, hi, how are you? It's good to meet you. If you're returning, hello, welcome back. It is so great to see you again. As always, you guys, if you want to book a personal reading with me, and you should, the link is in the description box below. All right. Let's get into it, kiddos. All right. All right, there's some things up in the air. There's some things up in the dark. Um, there might be a little bit of gossip and fighting at work. Pay it no mind. Pay it no mind. Just keep working, just doing you. You might find you have some haters this month who just, you know, you're busy doing you and they don't like it. Well, that's their fucking problem, okay? That's their fucking problem. You are super tapped in with the high priestess here. You guys, your intuition is on point, okay? It is like the subconscious is speaking and you are listening and it will be revealing some things um, I feel particularly um, at the workplace. I feel like there might be some disappointments, like maybe you didn't get a promotion or maybe, you know, there was some personal disappointments or some financial stuff. Maybe you were hoping for a raise and it didn't come. Pay it no mind. Again, you have more than you think. You have more that you think. You just need to pay attention to it. You're finding your flow this month. There is lots of abundance. There's lots of newness coming in here with the Eight of Wands. So don't underestimate that. Don't let a little disappointment get you down. Make sure you keep an eye on what it is that you want. Some of you might be getting a mentor, somebody who's really charismatic and like, um, this feels, this is coming in. This is a specific message for someone, I don't know. But maybe you're getting somebody to help you with your social media. Like somebody who you know, is really charismatic and people are drawn to them and they have a really good following and you're like, I want to know how you do it, you know, and you're kind of getting this mentoring. And it doesn't necessarily have to be about social media. This could just be a, a myriad of things. It could be financial um, advising. It could be a supervisor at work who's showing you to do something or a trainer, you know, or maybe you're just tapping into that energy for yourself and you are that for somebody else. Slow but steady forward, right? Like we're, we're working towards our manifestation. Abundance is drizzling in slowly but surely. It is there, but it is slow. So just keep saving. Tuck, tuck money away, like stash it, like this sort of like, ooh, nest egg, like you're going to start saving for something fun. So what is it that you want to save for? Start putting money away. Start squirreling it away. Let it slowly but surely build up. Uh, okay. I would meditate on some past habits maybe in return, like when it comes to 
what is your relationship with money? What do you, what do you want it for? What is it doing for you? How do you want it to work for you? What do you want to do for work? Some of you maybe need to, um, take a sabbatical. Like some of you might need to take a leave of absence from your job. Um, some of you might be just up and quitting where you just, you know, did a little soul searching and you're like, nah, who, no, 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 not for me. Or you could just be, you know, figuring out, all right, what do I need? What do I need to tweak? You know, there's a little bit of rest and soul searching and meditation that needs to happen in regards to some, some aspect in regards to your career and your money or both that need to be changed, that need to be, you know, let go of in a sense. And we're kind of holding on too tightly too here with the four of pentacles. So These are all going to kind of be revealed to you as the month goes. As long as we're listening to our intuition and we're not really settling into the lack mentality. Search out a mentor if that's what you feel that you need. And it doesn't necessarily have to be a male. It's just that leadership, right? It's just the energy of the king. So, you know, don't be afraid to reach out to others don't buy into drama don't buy into lack mentality don't listen to the news don't buy into that just you do you you do you this is your life okay so have some fun you know taking a look at some things and just work and do you this feels very authentic. Very Scorpio vibes. So I appreciate you guys being here. Let that intuition run the show this month. Listen to it implicitly. I will talk to you very, very soon on the next video. And I wish you the best of luck. Bye.